more painful for Americans than talking with an ex or walking across hot coals? Both things sound horrible. It looks like good. How about picking out a health care plan? That sounds worse. That sounds bad, too. <laughs> it does sound bad. A survey by Aflac shows three quarters of responders said reading about health benefits is long, complicated, and stressful. And almost half of the people surveyed said they'd rather talk to an ex. <laughs> uh, I would just like to say, let me think. Uh, most of my exes, no interest in talk. That does sound worse, most of them. You? I don't want to talk to any of them. <laughs> Allie? <laughs> Certainly not. No. Certainly not. Most of Allie's exes, <laughs> nobody wants to talk to those people. <laughs> right? I think that's fair. Is that too let's much information? I think we're let's talk track, about, right? I am getting distracted by that. Yeah, so let's talk about open enrollment, right? Yeah. Because this is the deal. Uh, open enrollment is complicated. It's, uh, for most people, it's overwhelming. A quarter of millennials surveyed here, and this is a survey of 1,900 adults, 18 years and older, but a quarter of the millennials, 18 to 36 uh -huh. year olds, said, I admit it, I didn't spend enough time researching my options. And then 70% said they, they fear that they wasted money because they made a bad sure. choice. I mean, I think we've all been there. Yeah, I think it's kind of like going to the grocery store. Are you going to go generic? Are you going to go high-end brand are you going to go organic food like you just don't know yeah. which choice you're going to make and then I think a lot about people don't know how much money do I put in maybe a health savings account will mm -hmm. I use it all will I have money left over am I wasting money there are so many questions and you don't necessarily know the answers to those questions there are a lot of tools Matt when you go to look at and you understand over the years where whether it's the federal government has come up with tax benefits for people so they, there are all these products and I think sometimes you look at the list and you're like I don't know like I guess just keep it the same like I, I don't know I think that's what most people do the choices are overwhelming and it, it makes a ton of sense that that younger group of people, 18 to 35, uh, have the most trouble with this just because they haven't had as much experience with that. Maybe you're going to the doctor if you get a cold yeah. or uh, a yearly physical, but you haven't had to make a whole lot of health insurance decisions mm -hmm. when you're mm -hmm. relatively young and healthy. When you look at this, this, uh, this idea of open, open enrollment, mm -hmm. it's not only your health care choice, your flex spending, but it's also that daycare flex spending, yep. your parking or commuter flex spending. You've got all of these things, and, and then on top of it, you look at uh, retirement. Yeah. And then think, you understand why so many people don't enroll in a 401k plan, because you're like, I don't know which, mm -hmm. you know, how many choices do you get, 10? Yeah, and I think a lot of people, too, you don't know, maybe maybe you're thinking about having a baby, but you don't know for sure, sure. if you will get pregnant within the next year, and yeah. if that's in terms of yeah. how you're going to spend your money for daycare. What should be done? Thing. What what could be well, done here? I, I mean, I, oftentimes these open enrollment things are just big group meetings in a conference room, and it's hard to figure out, like, okay, how does this apply to me? I do feel like if people made appointments and had the time to talk through mm -hmm. their situation, with somebody who understands this an better, an expert, yeah, then you could make more educated choices about what is best for you rather than just trying to get that information from a big meeting. Well, I do think that there are those people available. People just have to take the time to yeah. do that. Also those. true. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Too many choices, I think. Mm -hmm. Fewer choices, make them good choices. A or B, and then you're fine. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right.